Look at that. When Beth Allen has a drill in her hands, I tell you right now. All right, Scott Moak here. Thanks for joining us, Beth. Best happy reviews time, and you're already drilling things. I I'm love it. I'm happy to be here. The drill is the most important tool in my toolbox. I, it's my favorite tool of all time. That's a big statement coming from a DIY expert like you. I'm telling you, it, you there's so many things that you can do with this. All right. Now, obviously, we can drill holes, we can drive screws, but there are other things that we can do that will save us time, money, and stress. I love it. Let's so, hear it. And I see you already got the brush loaded in I there. I do. I have, I have the brush loaded. So what I have here is um, a standard drill. This is um, the DeWalt 20 volt. This is the number one drill on thebestreviews.com. Okay. So we love this drill. Um, this other one, this is our Black & Decker, and this is our best bang for the buck. But what I love, doesn't matter what drill you have, is that you can put an attachment on here and you turn it into a cleaning tool. How mm -hmm. awesome is that? Let's do it. I have fibromyalgia, so a lot of scrubbing is really difficult to do. But you put this, you can clean your shower, you can clean your grout. How about the pool deck? How about the front steps, you know, where the cement has gotten discolored? You pop that on there, and you can just get right to cleaning. Hey, hey, hey. Super You're easy. You're giving people, significant others, a, a, a checklist of what they're yes, going to clean next. Yes. I love it. But don't give it. it as a women's holiday gift. Not no, at we all. Don't Never want that. All right, what other tools can we put next in Next up is the garden auger. How awesome is this that you can actually get your plants planted neatly, evenly, and consistently for all of those annuals and for all of those bulbs for good. the spring. It's good. You don't need the trowel. You just take your drill out back. Yep. You just pop it onto your drill and there you go. And you can drill those holes. All right. Super easy to get that done. Now, when it comes to paint, I say stirred, mm. not shaken. Of course. Yes. Okay. When you buy paint at the store, they shake it in the big machine. That's right. So it's all properly mixed and the pigmentation is set. For sure. But you bring it home, it sits for a day, a week, six months later, you try to or do it. Or longer, a, sorry. Yeah. You know, before you get around to it. And then the colors separate. You get out the big paint stirrer and it's not right. Put this on your drill and you're going to fully mix all of the pigments so that your paint is the color you intended it That's to really be. That's really good. It's super easy. Now, the other tool, which is so easy, is that you can sharpen your tools with your drill. You oh, want to really? be the sharpest tool in the shed, well, right? Well, I've wanted to for a long time, but sadly, <laughs> I don't think it's possible. But there's actually a tool you can use to do Yes, that. it's a pumice stone that you put on the end of your drill, and you can sharpen scissors, chisels, your garden tools. I've even done my mower blades. Oh my goodness, who knew the drill was so versatile? Yeah. You did. I did. Say, where can people go for more information? What if they're shopping for a drill and they want they, they, they want to know, you know what they need? Where, where do they look? Go to bestreviews.com. We've done the work for you, and we have made um, your buying process simpler. And you can choose, again, our top and our best bang for the buck. Beth Allen, great work with Thank the you. drill. Oh, my goodness. <laughs>